toot, whistle, plunk and boom is an educational adventures in music animated short film produced by Walt Disney Productions, and originally released to theaters by Buena Vista Distribution on November 10, 1953. A sequel to the first adventures in music cartoon, the 3D short melody, toot, whistle, plunk and boom is a stylized presentation of the evolution of the four orchestra sections over the ages with a horn, toot, a flute, whistle, a guitar, plunk, and a drum, boom. The first Disney cartoon to be filmed and released in widescreen cinemascope, toot, whistle, plunk and boom won the 1954 Academy Award for Best Short Subject, Cartoons. In 1994, it was voted number 29 of the 50 greatest cartoons of all time by members of the animation field. Like many of Disney's early Cinemascope films, a flat version shot in 4-3 ratio was made for theaters that were not equipped for Cinemascope. This required rearranging the artwork for some shots to accommodate the smaller screen. Shots of multiple repeated characters, like the bird chorus at the end, for instance, were cut in half, using two repetitions instead of four. The most notable change comes at the transition from the end of the boom section to the parade that starts the finale. In the Cinemascope version, the background and characters fade out, leaving the drum in the last scene alone. The drum then jumps from the side of the screen to the center, and the parade fades in. In the flat version, the camera zooms in on the drum dissolving into the parade and zooms back out. Other changes occur in the flat version. Some of the characters like the Kitchen Bird Band members near the beginning and the String Quartet members get closer together. Bach with his clarinet has a book of sheet music with Bach written on it instead of the busts around him. Plung morphs into the Egyptian playing the harp instead of fading out to him. In the Cinemascope version, the grand piano also in the plunk segment stretches, but in the flat version, it stays a certain size. 